Welcome to this short presentation about the new Dynamic Displacement Sensor by Move Solutions. The Dynamic Displacement Sensor is the new version of Move Solutions DEC Sensor, the first sensor patented by Move Solutions. It has now been updated into a version with new features in order to increase reliability, accuracy, stability, and efficiency of the measurement. The wireless dynamic displacement sensor provides uniaxial measurements along the gravitational axis, which is the Z, or to the perpendicular axis, the X or Y. It's extremely easy to install, ultra low noise performance, great resolution, a built-in long life battery, IP67 waterproof rating, and an integrated temperature sensor. With this upgraded version, we have also introduced new terminology. So instead of the DEC, it is now the DDS, the Dynamic Displacement Sensor. What does the sensor monitor? The Dynamic Displacement Sensor is a wireless device that remotely monitors the dynamic displacement and frequencies of infrastructure. The dynamic displacement measures the displacement of a structure from its initial position due to dynamic forces. It is typically represented as a distance in millimeters and it provides information about how much the infrastructure moves and in which direction. The frequencies measure the rate or speed at which a structure vibrates or oscillates when subjected to dynamic forces. They are expressed in hertz and provide information about how quickly the structure is vibrating. Monitoring dynamic displacement and frequencies of a structure helps assess the structural response to dynamic forces such as strong winds, machinery operation, heavy traffic or earthquakes, and can provide valuable insights into the structural health and integrity of the infrastructure during such events. So what has changed with the DEC sensor? Let's go into details of what's really changed from the old version to the new version. So at first glance, you can see that something that has changed is the dimensions of the DEC sensor. So the new dynamic displacement sensor is much smaller, has a more compact design that facilitates its installation and use in a variety of different environments, including more critical and regulated sites such as railways. Before, it was required to know in advance whether the sensor needs to be installed on the floor, on the wall, or on the ceiling to monitor horizontal or vertical displacement. Now, there are just two versions of the dynamic displacement sensor. So instead of six variants, you now have two variants, either vertical or horizontal. Here you can see an example of how the same device that monitors dynamic vertical displacement can be installed in three different ways, on the floor, on the wall, or on the ceiling, according to the needs of the project. If the dynamic displacement sensor for vertical displacement needs to be installed on the wall, all the client needs to do is to take the device and install it where it is required. The same applies to ceiling mounting. In fact, the standard configuration of the dynamic displacement sensor for vertical displacement makes it ready for both ceiling and wall mounting. When you need to install a vertical dynamic displacement sensor on the floor, you will have to remove it from its plate, rotate the plate 180 degrees, and reposition the sensor on it so that the device can be installed on the floor without being rotated itself. This would be the right configuration for a dynamic displacement sensor for vertical displacement that needs to be installed on the floor. The other version of the dynamic displacement sensor has been designed to monitor horizontal displacement. In this case, with the standard configuration, the device can be installed on the ceiling, wall, or floor without any changes or rotations. That means that the same one can be used for many different types of installation, floor, ceiling, and wall, using one side of the plate or the other one. So when a client needs to monitor the horizontal displacement of a structure, 
they will need to buy the dynamic displacement sensor for horizontal displacement and then use it as it is for ceiling, wall, or floor mounting. Thank you for watching this short presentation on our new dynamic displacement sensor. If you have any questions, feel free to send us an email or call us. Our team will be happy to support you and answer any questions.